Yeah, hello guys. Um, this is just a short video about uh, using hard drive with uh, with uh, DJ Pro. Uh, I've seen a lot of people having problem commenting that they can they hate DJ Pro because they can't use the uh, external hard drive. Um, they've been using Serato before. They wanted to switch. They have a problem. And because of that, they can use the external hard drive. They go back to Serato DJ. So uh, if you're having that problem, I think uh, this video will solve it for you. Um, the good things about using um, the external hard drive is two things. Um, the first of all, yes, you can import your crates. I repeat again, you can import your crates you have created with Serato DJ Pro into DJ Pro. You can import it. So DJ Pro has the software where you can actually do it. So not to talk too much, to do that, you're gonna go to where you have playlist. If you look at your playlist right here, you can see where I'm, where I'm pointing at right now. So you see these three dots right here? Those three dots click on it once you click on it you have one option that says import crate so once that one come out this one is going to appear uh once this one appear don't just go ahead and import it you see this one right here change location once you click on locations look for this one comes out look for your external hard drive like right here I have DKE, which is right here. Um, that's the way I name my hard drive. As my external hard drive, once you click on DKE, your hard drive is going to come up. Once it comes up, click Select. All right. Once you click Select, click Import. It will take time. It will import all your Serato Create. I'm not going to do it right now because I have done it before. It will import all your Serato Create the way it was, the way they were when you created them with Serato DJ Pro. It will import them into your um, into your DJ Pro. So it will import all of them. I'm going to cancel right now because I'm already done with it. It will import them. Once you're done, you go back, you just click on your, like this is my crate right now, the one I imported. If you click on the, the, the little, um, the little sign right here, drop down, the drop down, um, click right there. So you're going to see all, these are all the created, I, I created with Serato DJ Pro. I have all of them here. Everything is right here. You will have your cue points that you created with Serato DJ Pro. You will have your safe loop that you created with the Serato DJ Pro. So the only thing that is going to be different is maybe when you color code your track selections, the color is not going to follow. So that will be the only thing that is missing. So um, for you to do that, you just have to review again and, you know, color code all your color code all the playlist, whatever you wanted to play. You can redo it here. You know, you just click the arrow button. You can click color. You just go ahead and color whatever track you prefer to play. So another thing that you could do with an external hard drive that is that I really love, because there are sometimes you want to quickly download songs from wherever you're getting your music from. If you download it, if you choose the locations of where you will download your song, if you choose that particular external hard drive that you're using, you can make those songs that you just downloaded to appear on your music collections even without dragging them to your playlist or whatever it is. So the way to do that, you're going to go to DJ Pro, you go to Settings, then you go to the Library, Library here, you're going to go down import. You're going to see automatically import new file 
added to the following folders into my collections. Then you can click the plus sign. Once you click the plus sign, then you can select the same. This is my hard drive, right? The one I showed you guys before. This is my hard drive that I selected. So anything that I download into this hard drive, it will come to my music collections. It will come to my music collection. To get those new songs that you just added, if you click on recently added songs, you will see all of them here. So this is a quick, a, a quick video. I think I'm going to be making video because a lot of people are having problems. So I want to say it again. This software is the best. I have used the, uh, the virtual DJ. I have used Serato DJ. And I have used this DJ Pro. So finally, I switch. I have been using this um, DJ software for a long time. I do not have any problem. It works with my controller. This is the DDJ SZ2. It works perfectly with it. This is an old controller. And I have um, DDJ, um, DDJ SRT1000. Works perfectly with it. And I have here, I have, um, I have here, um, what do you call it again? Rainfall. Rainfall. So I have four, it works perfectly with it. All right, peace. I hope you liked the video. Now subscribe to my channel. God bless you.